What's up guys? Surgical here. And I've got an exciting uh, domination on firing range for you today. I decided that I was going to put this video up here uh, just because this was one of the some of the most fun I've had in a long time uh, playing domination. This is definitely one of my more memorable domination matches and it's just really entertaining and I know that normally when I do commentaries I usually talk about uh, things, uh, you know, tips, and uh, I just did some SMG tips and stuff like that. But on this video, I'm basically just going to do a commentary. And so, if, if you don't like that sort of thing, uh, you know, if you like some of my other video stuff, this one's not going to be my normal uh, uh, commentary. So, in this match, uh, I start out uh, playing uh, normally like I normally play uh, Firing Range. Um, and firing, firing range is my uh, most favorite level in uh, Call of Duty. Uh, I really like it uh, because uh, there's so many different ways you can play uh, firing range. And uh, there's a, a lot of uh, traffic routes, a lot of hiding places, a lot of great cover. And uh, it's really, this is a, a really hard level for uh, a lot of, for good players to trap you in. So um, I feel pretty confident on this level, even if we're going up against, uh, you know, a bunch of really skilled players who are all playing together, who might be in the same clan or something like that, that um, I can function well enough to where I won't be getting spawn trapped or, uh, you know, just completely shut down. Now, I mean, this is a good level uh, for uh, beginning players and... Uh, and advanced players but this is normally how I like to play I like to play the, the high spots the high ground I normally like to run across that beam if you watch any of my other firing range videos run across that beam to the other side and you know just keep going back and forth up here on this top level here I do like this area over here by C flag better than the one the upstairs area over uh, by A flag the only disadvantage of this uh, upstairs area here is that you really can't uh, take out the guys who are in the trailer which is what you can do from the other side but one thing you can do from the little two-story barn over here by C flag is that you can defend both C and B flag from this spot which you can't do from the other area <clears throat> now it is about this point right now where I'm like uh, somebody's already got dogs already and you know we must be running up against uh, a team with some considerable skill right here because look at the score 53 to 40 and somebody's already got dogs and we've already lost all of our flags and chopper gunners out and everything like that so I pretty much uh, changed my tactics from right now <laughs> watch this you know uh, that guy I put about four bullets in him I, I took my finger off the trigger I know you've probably done that before and he kills me you know, I, I shoot him in the back, and then I realize he doesn't die, and I try to knife him, and then he knifes me. And that is a guy named Youngzy, and uh, he has an incredible game, this game. And I will be doing a commentary from his point of view in this same exact game. So you're going to get to watch this game uh, from my point of view, and then I'm going to do a special commentary uh, where I try to... Uh, watch through watch the game played through his eyes and uh, I think that's gonna be pretty good but anyway as I was uh, talking about a while ago it's about this point in the game you know I've seen the chopper gunner seen the dogs you know we were in pretty good shape and now you know we're not doing so good so it was it, a little bit before this point whenever he brought the dogs out I was like alright well I'm not gonna be able to play my normal way on firing range, I'm gonna have to get out, you know, grab some flags, you know, we're gonna have to increase the pressure uh, here because um, he is, uh, this other team is definitely taking control of this game. So I don't, I don't get to play the way that I normally play because um, I normally just try to kind of control things on, uh, uh, just try to control traffic uh, from that upstairs area right up there. And, you know, uh, this was uh, the last game of my uh, heralded uh, seven-game win streak. It was right after this game that the lobby closed, and I got put into a new game, and my, my all-time greatest uh, seven-game win streak came to a sad end. And 
I wish I had uh, one of these uh, high dollar like Turtle Beach headsets or whatever because I really wish I could do the live commentary and record you know on my headset and what the other guys are saying stuff like that while I'm playing because we had a couple guys with headsets in this game and you know we were communicating uh, really well and you know with all the uh, noob tubing and there's guys that hide at various places in here and all the air support that comes in for this other team there was a lot of talking on the headsets and he, this, this there's dogs already again you know and we're, we're we're falling behind now and you know I know we've got to step it up well, one thing that I have gotten better at doing uh, lately is really using the map and uh, using cover. Uh, if you can see uh, me uh, in various places, uh, the chopper gunner uh, is it, going to get me uh, several times here. And uh, this, and, and I'm on the headset right here. I'm like, there's a guy in that uh, little shack down there at the bottom of Sea Flag. He's taking me out. But anyways, you know, I, I've gotten better at using cover and uh, using the map. Uh, you know, and using my teammates. You know, uh, like in Modern Warfare 2, uh, you could pretty much uh, just be a loner and, you know, rack up some kills that way, especially with a sniper rifle. And, but in this game, uh, you know, I've noticed, you know, by watching uh, better players, you know, using the map, using your teammates, uh, and, and judging from where your teammates are, uh, you can tell where the uh, enemy is most likely going to be. And that, that is one thing that I'm paying more attention to. Um, uh, the other team, uh, they spent a lot of time in this trailer, and I, we, we, we've got two flags now, and I'm going to try to just keep them out of the trailer, and, you know, I can keep an eye on B flag from here, and I'm screaming on the uh, mic right now, I'm like, somebody, if you've got a rocket, take out that chopper gunner. And I didn't have a class set up uh, with with Estrella or anything uh, right now, and I quickly changed that because I normally always try to keep a ghost class with Estrella, but for whatever reason I didn't have one, so I had to stick with what I was got. And I knew that some of my teammates had some rockets, but for whatever reason they weren't. Uh, apparently the, the attack helicopter wasn't a big liability, so they weren't concentrating on it. And uh, right now, I think it's a pretty good uh, representation of why, uh, you know, better players, um, you know, may not have the best KDR in the world. And I don't really consider myself a really great player, but I think I'm pretty good. But my, my KDR is not great in this level. But when you're playing domination and you're trying to win, and, you know... At the, if you're losing towards the end of the game, there comes to a point where you just have to throw your KDR out the window and you have to start doing some mad rushing. And that's about the point right now. Because I'm trying to, I know that I've got a six game win streak going and I know that's my, my best. So I'm, I'm trying to keep that win streak alive. So I'm pretty adamant. You know, and talking on the talking on the mic right now, saying, you know, we can still do this. You know, just keep 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 those flags, keep those flags. I'm gonna try to take a flag because I know at this point right now we're at the time where we've got a triple cap because they've got a, you know a 32 point lead right now, and if we don't triple cap them, then they're going to win. And right about now, um, you know, there's that guy, that guy in the trailer. I was telling. Uh, you know, everybody else like, there's a guy in the trailer back there is killing me every time. And, you know, we were all going after him at the same time. But, you know, so so right now, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of out of control. <laughs> the RC cars, yeah. You know, I, I don't know how many times I die from kill streak stuff in this game. Between the RC car, the attack helicopter, the dogs. I bet 15 of my deaths come from... Uh, kill streak rewards in this game. Uh, yet another guy that I miss every time you know I watch these replays. I'm like, how did I miss that guy once again? And and then and that's why you don't drop shot with the SMG. And I did the SMG and took a bullet right in the skull as I was crouching down. 
And about this point right now, we lost B flag, and I was just about, you know, it's over. It's, that helicopter takes me out, and I thought about uh, just giving up right now. We're down 23 points, but, you know, I'm like, if y'all can hold down B and C, I'll take A. And I can't get it. So, something always keeps going wrong. And right now, we've got uh, B and C. The teammate comes over, and we take A. So we've got the triple cap on right now. It's an 18 point game, 195, 180 now. So, you know, I'm like, hold B and C, hold B and C. I'll hold A. I got my favorite gun, the FAMAS. Even got a little uh, scope on it and get nailed. And I don't know how the, that guy right there, because he killed both of us. I don't know how he doesn't take the A flag right there. And then I get killed trying to go back after him. There's a chopper gunner. And this may be the play of the game right there. Boom. Take him out. And that's it, folks. Don't call it a comeback, though. Anyways, my stats for this game, 35 and 32, 4 captures and 2 defends. Notice that 80 and 7 by Youngzy down there. That's the commentary I'm going to do later. God bless, guys.